Yeah, just, you know, happy we won. Got off to a tough start, but uh, kind of had a good response in the bottom of the first. Uh, and then felt like after that, we played really well. Um, obviously, all of our newcomers uh, kind of had good days. And uh, Trey Younger and Peyton Green, you know, had, had big days. Ellis, uh, really good day. And, uh, you know, I thought Tate McKee threw the ball really well. King kind of settled the game for the most part. Uh, but I thought Tate and Dawson Brown both, for me, uh, threw the ball really well. So good to see. It's good to get Goddad in the game. Played a lot of guys late. And uh, now we just got to, you know, get ready to go again tomorrow. I guess it was really important for your performance to uh, answer like that to be able to absorb that at such a moment. No question. I mean, we, you know, dug ourselves a deep hole, but uh, had a great first inning ourselves and kind of got back in the game. And, um, you know, and that's what you want to see when that happens. I guess after the, after the first, I think, three innings, you were fortunate only gave up two hits, which is really nice. You know, could you, you wanted to save some arms for the next two games going forward. Yeah, no doubt. I mean, we have a lot of guys we can pitch, so I really wasn't worried about how many arms we were throwing. I w Certainly would have liked to have seen uh, less walks and just our guys attacking the strike zone a little more. But I kind of felt like uh, King, for the most part, really good. But it, it, then McKee and Brown, I thought, just really settled it and threw the ball well. Three strikes, too. Yes, they did. Yeah, and with, uh, with Tate, you know, was, was he throwing it like that? I mean, uh, was he great, like, so far in the preseason or is that leading up to today? He's been very impressive. Yeah, just yeah, he's he's uh, he's really good, and um, you know, and so first time for a freshman getting out there. Thought he did a great job. You, you talked about the uh, transfers being really important. I think they combined for 13 hits this time. Uh, if it continues that way, it's you guess pretty good with your evaluation of what you brought into it. No question. You know they. Uh, you know, we we played an old lineup. I mean, I'll just you know we kind of just settled on we're going to play an older lineup. And uh, but all those guys we thought were good players. They've proven that they're good players already at this level. So to get them here uh, and then have them get off to the start that they got off to today, it's that's what we wanted to see. I'm sure it's tough tough outing for Perry, but you know it was just one of those days, I guess, where nothing went right. You know? No, he didn't. I mean, he j he just didn't have it. I mean, period, and uh, you know, he's he's a great pitcher. It's one game; he'll uh, he'll recover, and and uh, he's a hard worker, and he'll be back at it, and uh, he'll get it right. Uh, freshman, you know, Drew Barrett. Talk a little bit about his performance and see how you are when you can get off the fence and make it to the plate. Basically, he got off to a tough start. I told him after his second strikeout, I said, "Don't worry, you're going to hit a home run next time up," and he did. Uh, and then he got one right after that. He's a good player. He's very advanced for uh, for a freshman. And but you know, like a lot of freshmen, he's going to take his lumps. But I think he's one guy. If if he has a bat at bat or something doesn't go his way, he's going to keep fighting. And uh, happy to see him, you know, hit a couple uh, couple good ones there today. And I think he'll just keep getting better. The, uh, you said you went with an older lineup, a different lineup. You know, what did you see? Yeah, I think they're both really good players. Uh, Peyton Green has <laughs> done nothing but impress since he's uh, been here. And uh, Cam Jones is just a really, really good baseball player. Made a great play, a couple of really nice plays at first. And uh, you'll probably see him pitch a little tomorrow. So uh, both those guys are really uh, just really good baseball players. Yeah, more than likely. You know, Sabathia's had a good spring as well, uh, you know, and he was honestly a little under the weather today, but, you know, f said he was fine to go uh, to go play. But we definitely can have some moving parts that uh, we can move around and, uh, and, and just, you know, get more guys in the mix. Uh, yeah, I went into the portal this offseason coming out of graduating from Wofford. Um, grew up around here, knew knew what Ramsey's done with the offense the last, you know, few years. So 
when I got the when I got the text from him, it was kind of a home run. So. Just how how much or how important was it for you to get out early in the game and take the, the pressure off? No doubt. I mean, opening day is is always, you know, people kind of make it bigger than it is, and it's you know it's just another game. It's one of fifty six, but because it's the first one, there's definitely high. You know, anxiety. So when you can when you settle in and just play baseball, it, it definitely takes some weight off your shoulders. Did you have a hitter inside the park home run? Before you first, did? first one ever. Uh, kind of got it off that pad, and when I saw that bounce off the fence, I was like, I gotta run. So <laughs> started booking it. Was that the fastest you ran? Probably the fastest you ran. I hope not. I hope <laughs> I've I hope I've run that fast before. But is the time when you six feet or? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's been a while since I've run a sixty, but I've I've run one back in the day. So. I mean, yeah, I like to think I could play all three positions. I know at, at Wofford, I've bounced around a little bit, but probably probably spent most most of my time in left. So, um, you know, wherever they want to put me, I, I feel like I can play there. So, what was the mentality like as a, a, a team coming into the dugout after the top of the third? You know, we we knew we can hit, and you know, we we trust our bullpen. But I think we had all the confidence in the world. We know that we can swing it, so we didn't think that six runs is going to be much of an issue. So, so many new faces coming in. It's definitely happened. It's you know it happens organically, but um, it's been good. Pre-spring was was good, getting guys together, and you know when the season starts like this, it's really easy to kind of form those relationships. Um, so it's 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 happening. Um, obviously, it's a process with a bunch of new faces, but we're definitely you know becoming pretty close. So be grateful for some of the older faces that have been here that you you know some of the leadership or the pitching. Or definitely, definitely. I mean, there's there's um you know there's so many guys and so many kind of people from different places, but you know, with with kind of what Ramsey has done with the offense the last few years, I think a lot of people have bought in, and you know, we're, we we try to you know hit good pitches, and when we get good pitches, hit them hard. So definitely bought into that. Thanks, guys. Yeah, Absolutely. Appreciate it. Ben, you were out there uh, last year. You uh, finished up 150 <laughs> in one inning. Mm -hmm. What was your mindset uh, when you wanted to go out there? Was it you got some innings? I mean, really, the, the main thing I was just focused on was putting up a zero in that second inning, um, you know, after coming out. And um, both teams got off to a little bit of a rocky start, defensive and pitching-wise. So I just wanted to put up the first zero uh, in the game for either side and just kind of try and stabilize things. The, uh, it's, I guess it's nice to have Ramsey do that all those times. Yeah, absolutely. I, I mean, I, I knew as soon as they scored a few runs that that, that game was a long ways from over. Uh, and, and so I knew I just had to do my job and, and kind of try and stabilize things. and let our offense get back in the game. Um, I had no doubt that we were going to come back and, and win that game. Now, is that a, a type of role you're kind of expecting to be in this season? You know, coming right out of the bullpen right after the start? Yeah, I, I like kind of that, that first out type of role. Um, I, I feel like I'm well suited for it. You know, hopefully it's not going to be in the second inning um, a lot of time. And, you know, I, I've got all the confidence in the world in Terry Bussey. You know, tonight wasn't his night, but but he's a great pitcher and he's going to be a, a huge asset for this team this year. Um, so, you know, I, I like kind of that most of the time it's more middle relief, um, trying to bridge, bridge to the back end of the bullpen. I like that role. I uh, feel like I'm well suited for it. You had your first nine and a half against Prince Taylor. Mm -hmm. What was that like compared to some of the innings you've had here? Uh, it was great. I mean, you know, I, I, he came out and then the, the next hitter, I think I could give up a two RBI base hit. But he, he had a great message for me and was very encouraging out there. And, um, you know, so, so it was a good meeting. I just didn't execute after he uh, – after he went back off, I'm, I'm sure I'll hear about that from him tomorrow. <laughs> it's like, man, you, you're, you're messing up my, my mound visit stats. So but that one's on me. Thanks so much, Ben. Now, as you, you, know, you just threw the 60 pitches today, I'm mm -hmm. guessing that's how you look coming into the weekend. Yeah, I, I haven't talked to, had a chance to talk to Matt really about that yet. Um, so we'll see. Uh, I would imagine that I'll probably be down the next couple. I almost certainly will be down tomorrow. I, I, I could throw on Sunday if I really needed to. Um, so, but we'll see. I'm excited to, to see our other guys throw this weekend. What was the impression from Matt as he threw through the ball? Uh, Tate threw the, um, the lights out of the ball. He looked great. Uh, Tate's going to be um, an all-ACC level pitcher here at some point in his career. He's, he's a stud. He's, um, he's got the right makeup mentally, um, and, and he's a very talented young arm. Uh, you know, so as for me, coming out of the game with a guy on base, I normally am like I, I don't want to do that because I, I don't want to entrust my runners to somebody else especially not to a true freshman making his first outing most of the time. But I really had um, no worries with Tate coming in there. I was confident he was going to come in and do a good job um, just because he's that kind of pitcher.